Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Nat Walsh. I am involved in a little Instagram hop today, but I decided to do a video of my little card. So I've been really, really, I, if you've been watching me too much, you will know that I'm relatively clean and simple, although I do go a little bit crazy town when I make up a little image, like, you know, draw a little scene or something like that. But generally speaking, I'm a little bit clean and simple, which I love. So that's what we have today, a little clean and simple card. I will leave a link down below in the description box over to Instagram. As I said, this is a Instagram hop. Mm, not everyone's going to have a video. I don't even know if there's anyone else that does, is going to have a video. But I decided to record it. So we have, we're going to have a little bit of fun. And honestly, there is, you have a chance to win a $20 gift card for TL, at two TLC Designs shop. So the hop will end on the 22nd of January at 11.59 PST time. So in Pacific Standard Time. I don't know. I'm in Australia, so we don't have PT time. But I will leave that information down below. And the winners are going to be announced on the 25th of January. So, yeah, check, go over and check it out. So this is to celebrate the new release. There is quite a few really cute little things. So we've got a bit of a mixture of images. The counter that I'm coloring right there is from Parlor, the new stamp set Parlor. The ice cream, the little straw holders and that sort of thing, they are from Parlor Pals. The little mouse is from, where is the little mouse from? Kitten Gems. Sorry, I just couldn't quite remember that because it's a mouse and it's got Kitten Gems, so I was thrown for a second. The sentiment is actually from Unicorn Happiness, which is just another, uh, it's an older set. So I, I, I took it that the little mouse is on the ground and he's found for some reason a little, I'm sorry if you can hear clunking going on in my kitchen. He's found a little mouse, so he, a little ice cream thing so he's talking to the ice cream and he's like you're a rare find so I just thought that was really really cute maybe it's just me we are going to use a little bit of let me pronounce this properly tetrid color combination so we have very clearly a ready brown ready we're going to go with a ready orange sort of thing and color scheme we have a blue green that we're going to use so that's our two that's two of our combos so if you don't know a tetrid and i'm not perfect at this so um the, my pronunciation may be a little bit off is where you have four colors that are complementary colors so we've got the blue green and the yellow orange, yellow orange sort of color, that's a split complementary, not split complementary, that's a complementary color. Okay. The next two colors are also complementary colors. And we, we do have, we are going to throw in one little more color in there, but on the whole, we have a tetrid of color. Our ground, I'm going to use some warm greys and we're just going to have a highlight over on our left hand side. And I'm going to, this is also going to help me remember that I'm going to do it left hand side because I quite often do front facing. When we go up to colour the little bits and pieces that are on top of our counter, it's going to help me remember. So if you're like me sometimes, I don't do this all the time. 
and most of the time I just do front facing and if I don't tend to do my floor I tend to sometimes mix up my shadows I'm not perfect it's okay so we've got W4, W2 and W1 let us go back to what I used for my my counter we have E18 E19 now that sort of screws with you with your head sort of thing a little bit but E19 is a little is a little bit it's just different I don't understand why but it is it should be darker but to me it's not but maybe that's just me and we have E17 so that's our counter the well the front of our counter the actual top of our counter I did google sort of I digress I did google sort of American diners and I know that they the photos that I found no doubt this is not all of them but a lot of the photos I found were very um very 70s very quite a few red red and white honestly so I sort of thought my colors here are a little bit left field and that might rather be a bit cool so I didn't go with red red and white but that's what we did my little condiments and my little ice cream bowl we have v17 and v15 so this is a start of our other complementary color and what goes with purple is green so we have some really nice bright colors with yg17 and yg13 so i've kept my shadows for my rounded things to the right i haven't fluffed too much my bigger because the i'm going to assume this straws um is a bit bigger i did a tiny little bit on the right but again i didn't worry about it too much they are very quite small and very very cute the mouse is a mixture sort of a so we went down to an E17 for our counter with our mouse we're going to go E15 and E13 so it's still going with the family it's just going to be a little bit lighter now you're going to oh yeah my chocolate and then I'm going to come in with a little bit of uh, C2 for any white parts now you are going to lose a little bit of footage here I have a new camera you might be able to see that it's a little bit a little my skin color is a little bit different um, thanks to my awesome parents they bought me a camera for Christmas we're so excited but I'm still learning it so I played around with a little bit of sequins and then I opted for some stardust stickles so you're only going to see them when once they're put on the screen because I forgot to zoom out and I went off screen so we've got B02, B00 and b 40s for our little bit of glass just for a bit of soft thing and that's going to be pretty much my colour leave um go over and check out the Instagram post make sure you leave a comment and be in the running for the $20 gift card to TLC designs I hope you enjoy I hope you have a great day and I will talk to you hopefully very soon take care bye